Hello, my name is Kei Narushima, and I am president of Celsius Incorporated. I would like to present to you the company's financial results for the second quarter of the fiscal year, ending December 31st, 2024, Q2. These are the financial results for the six months ended June 30th, 2024. Net sales were 4.06 billion yen, and operating profit was 1.1 billion yen. Both of these results represent progress of over 50% toward the full-year financial results forecast. Please note that the listed progress rate is the figure for the full-year financial results forecast before revisions, which I will explain later. Next, I'd like to provide more detail on the progress toward the full-year financial results forecast. Net sales are proceeding roughly as projected, at 52% of the full-year forecast. In earnings, Operating profit is at 66% of forecast, ordinary profit is at 76%, and profit has already exceeded the forecast at 126%. All of these results indicate progress significantly above 50%. After the disclosure of the Q2 financial results on August 2, 2024, the full-year financial results forecast was revised on August 9, 2024 based on solid financial results for the first half ended June 30th and for the following month, July 2024. The full-year forecast for net sales was revised upward by 3% from the initial forecast to 8 billion yen, based on annual recurring revenue, ARR, on sales from subscriptions to Clip Studio Paint and expectation of firm sales trends. For operating profit, the full-year forecast was revised upward by 20% from the initial forecast to 1.98 billion yen. Although costs rose related to preparation for listing on the TSE Prime market, the company benefited from streamlining of development investment in view of the company-wide balance of revenues and expenditures and from continuing measures to revise costs. As you can see here, ordinary profit and profit are both expected to reach record highs. I would now like to explain how we're strengthening our returns to shareholders. This is the dividend for the fiscal year ending December 31st, 2024. The year-end dividend is increased by 2 yen per share to 12 yen. When the year-end dividend of 12 yen is combined with the interim dividend of 12 yen, the total dividend is 24 yen per share. This figure represents an increase of 12 yen per share compared with the fiscal year ended December 31st, 2023. Now, I would like to discuss acquisitions of Treasury shares. During the one-year period beginning March 1st, 2024, the company expects to acquire 2 billion yen worth of Treasury shares. The company has already acquired 1 billion yen worth of Treasury shares as of June 30th, 2024, and expects to acquire the remaining 1 billion yen worth by February 28th, 2025. Specific purchases will be disclosed as they are decided. I will now provide an overview of each business segment of the company. This is an overview of the content production solutions business. Net sales rose 16% year-on-year to 3.538 billion yen, while operating profit rose 26% year-on-year to 1.463 billion yen. Both sales and profits reached record levels. Each indicator for our flagship product, Clip Studio Paint, is trending smoothly upward, as you can see here. As of June 2024, ARR is 3.71 billion yen, exceeding 300 million yen per month. This is an overview of the content distribution solutions business. Net sales in the six months ended June 30, 2024, rose 2% 2 year-on-year -year to 521 million yen an operating loss of 358 million yen was recorded. Three main activities are noteworthy here. The company undertook promotional activities to foster more widespread use of DC3 solution. We also implemented DC3 with business operators and engaged in collaborations on content such as anime, games, and movies. Moreover, the company continued to invest in development to bolster the quality of solutions.